What is going on everybody? It's a beautiful day today here at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida. And today we found a pristine Newmar King Air that just became available for $455,555. This is Newmar's flagship coach and is a very classy color combination with the lighter colors with the white and beige. And when we get inside of this coach, you'll see that the interior pairs very well with the exterior of this coach. Now this has the Cummins 600. It's on the Spartan K3 chassis and is loaded with features that you're going to find in the King Airs. Now the best part about this coach is it is available here at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida, where it is undergoing an extensive PDI process and has just finished its extensive detail process. And there are a lot of big things happening at the Motor Coach Store. Uh, we're currently at the old facility where there's still a few coaches over here, but a lot of the coaches are transferring over to the new facility. The Motor Coach Store is always looking for high quality individuals to join the team here. Everything from the detail department to highly skilled technicians and orientation specialists. There's a lot of great opportunities here. So if you do want to join the team, you can always reach out to the motorcoachstore.com and get in touch with either Bradley Twait or Rob. The Motor Coach Store is a boutique type operation, different than any RV dealership out there, completely different than the big box stores. And when we go through this coach, you're gonna be able to see the level of detail and the level of care that this coach has received. And when you purchase this coach from the Motor Coach Store, you'll have an in-depth orientation going over the coach, making sure you understand how to use everything. You can spend the night or multiple nights in the coach, making sure that everything's working and that you understand how to operate everything. And when you go to the big box stores, they're usually gonna try to get you on the road in just a few hours. Really a lot of value in this coach being here. They also offer financing and take in trade. So let's take a closer look at this 17 King Air. Now, right now we have the slide rooms out and a lot of times when we're going through these coaches, we'll have the slide rooms in while we go through the basement bays. But I like to show the height of these slide rooms. You can see, I still have plenty of room still very easy to open these basement doors very effortless and just opening these bays up i can tell how clean this coach is and how well it's been cared for the first bay is going to be a large cargo area finished out with carpet bay two is going to be a power slide tray we just press a button here that's all lined with carpet it's got a thousand pound carrying capacity you do have this little tailgate that will swivel down as well to make loading and unloading easier. Now, if I'm seeing this right, I think this coach may have an option that I get really excited about. This may have the hammock option. I'm seeing these braces here on the side of the coach, and I am pretty sure that this may somehow turn into a hammock of some sort. So really a cool option that I have seen Newmar do on several coaches. We also do have the higher entertainment bay area here. I like that you're not taking up any room in your bays. And then when you open this up, it's blocked any glare from the sunlight. You've got a Sony TV with a Bose sound bar, extremely clean. And it's got this little switch right here where you can toggle your radio from inside the coach to play out here if you wanna hear just music outside. Bay three is gonna be another full pass through bay with this power slide tray. You can just press the button, very easy unloading and loading. Bay four is gonna be your cooler. It will slide out very easily on this manual tray. It's a Dometic cooler. And then you also have your Dirt Devil Central Vac. Some of your electronic components, outlets, lots of good stuff here. And then this bay is gonna be a spot where you can house some tools or cleaning supplies. You can see it's well lit there. So if you come out here at night, it's easy to see your stuff. And then behind this is gonna be those holding tanks. This being the King Air, it's gonna have the 200 gallon diesel fuel carrying capacity capacity and really a lot of heavy duty equipment in this coach. This next bay is gonna have your house battery bank back here. And when you look at earlier models, they had the battery bank in the front of the coach. And in the newer, later models, this is the 2017. So this was a body style change with a lot of big updates. I believe it might've been 17 or one of the years earlier where they brought the house battery bank from the front of the coach on the driver's side back here to go right in front of your 
rear tag axle just to help distribute that weight better and give it a better ride. So I see Michelin tires, date codes on the drive axle here are 2021 and I'm not seeing the date codes here on the, the tag axle here. It might be on the inside of the tire, but you can always get on the motorcoachstore.com, take a look at the check-in sheet, the build sheet, all of the specs for this coach are gonna be on the Motor Coach Store's website. There's always lots of cool coaches coming and going, so always worth checking out their website and their social media, their Instagram and Facebook. Uh, they've been getting a lot more active on that to keep you all in the loop of all these cool coaches that are coming and going. Here's a look at your DEF fill. And here Here's your chassis batteries, air dryer filter, your fuel water separator there. And then this is something I really like about the King Airs. It's got this hydraulic lift back here. You just press the lever and your engine hatch opens up. And here's a look at that Cummins 600, extremely clean on the Spartan K3 chassis. And then when we wanna close this up, just press this lever right there and it gently closes. I love the styling here with the King Air badges. And when you look, you can see these are not just you know cheap vinyl stick-on pieces. They're nice King Air badges. You've got the 360 camera. We have an emergency egress door over here with those frameless windows. It has a side radiator coach. You do have your DEF fill on both sides of the coach. And then here's a little spot to store your stinky slinky, your sewer hose there. And I love all of the details details like how Numar brings the paint scheme through the slide room here just to give it that nice finished look and then you can see this is the full wall slide on this coach so being on this side it is a little bit tighter to get below your slide room to access your base but we still want to show you what it's like so here's the other side of that house battery bank you can see that all that weight is right in front of that drive axle nice weight distribution and then this plumbing bay is so clean you can see the manifold system a power hose reel, your Valterra dump valves. Everything is very well labeled, very clean. You can monitor your tanks outside here. You've got a water filter, a little spot for paper towels, a spot to wash your hands. And here we have our power 50 amp cord reel with the surge guard power protection system. You've got your twin Xantrax inverters, full pass through bay. And I love how well lit everything is. I know it's daylight right now, but you can still see even in the daylight, how bright those lights are. And that's one thing Numar just does a great job with is all of their lighting, not only you know in the bays, but outside the coach, inside the coach, all around lighting is very important. So here's the other side of the full pass through bay, and you can see I'm bringing that slide tray out right now. Even with the slide room being out, when the tray comes all the way out, makes loading and unloading very easy. And then this bay up here, when they move that house battery bank in front of the drive axle, it freed up a lot of space here, so you have a lot of storage up front here and then up front is the electronics bay you can see it's extremely clean and then up front this has got the 12.5 Onan generator that's the big boy generator great looking front end and lots of cool little details like they tuck the wiper blades below this front cap here to keep it out of the sun so that rubber's not wearing as quickly and then again those beautiful king air emblems you've got the front camera up there cool lighting really a cool style you've got the door entry code here if you want to have a code to lock and unlock your coach. But let's take a look inside here. And I love this entryway with the screen door with that King Air emblem on the inside of the screen door that you can see from both sides. Beautiful light tile entryway. And when this is lit up at nighttime, it's just a beautiful entryway into the coach. Coming into this coach, I would call this like a rustic farmhouse style. And we do have all the ACs running right now, but Bradley Twait said he'd rather have us running the AC units and not sweating uh, than battling the noise. So I know some people will complain about noise uh, if we have the AC units running. This coach is nice and cool here. Coming up to the cockpit area, we can see the beautiful two-tone leather, and I would call this like a distressed leather with that beautiful King Air badge there on the armrest. You've got your two cup holders is your gear selector for your Allison 4000 transmission, your Hadley and your HWH leveling. Your engine brake controls are very simple. This also has memory seating, so it also does have the massaging seats as well. I'm a big fan of that. And then the size of these screens, you can see just huge screens up front here. And then it's got the comfort steer, uh, easy rear view mirror controls. Now I do love the big windows and the window panels around the windows, but on a hot day like 
like today, we can just press one button and put all these shades down. You can see it totally changes the vibe in here when we put those blinds down. This couch has that same beautiful distressed leather like we saw in the captain's chairs. And then when you look closely at all of these wall panels, there's a two-tone distressed leather with the cream and the brown colors and then puck lighting. Every little square inch of this coach has got a really nice design to it. Coming across the coach, we went right by the passenger's chair, but the passenger's chair is much wider if you want to have a furry friend tag along with. And then you have this little tray right here that will very easily slide out. So if you want to have some lunch or do some work on a laptop. And then your passenger also has a navigation screen here as well as a cup holder and AC controls uh, for the vents for the passenger. Then you've got a large Sony TV up top here. Beautiful cabinetry. There's just, the King Air is the top of the line, Newmar Motorhomes. One of the things about this King Air that's really a level up in other motorhomes you're going to see is the ceiling treatment here. Even with these air conditionings running right now, they're still very quiet. And then the way these are ducted, when the slide rooms come out, you don't have air blowing on the tops of the slide rooms. You've got it coming down your center aisle. So still very livable when the slide rooms come in and you're going down the road. They did a little uh, two-tone with the cabinetry here that I really like. If you look closely, you've got like a blonde and a walnut color wood. And then that all ties in together really well with this accent wall over here almost like a teak accent wall and then this booth is a really nice size very large the bigger folks would have no problem sitting here and then it has this backrest that curves around here so if you want to kick your foot out and just relax a little bit really nice and a beautiful cream color solid surface countertop that really ties in together well with these beautiful floors that are kind of like that rustic farmhouse feel all of the little details like the slide face here and like a chocolate distressed leather and you can see the crown molding up here lots of nice details in this coach and then if you do have guests and you want to extend out your booth this will extend out and then you can also extend this dinette you just lift that up here and then there is an extra leaf that will go in there so if you have guests you have plenty of seating to have a nice meal with the whole family coming into the galley lots of storage and the quality of the Newmar craftsmanship is just on another level. If you've had a chance to go to the Newmar factory in Napanee, Indiana, just really a pride of craftsmanship there. And all of the little details, like this drawer is gonna have the dovetail construction right here. And it's nice to just have a little pull-out drawer here to make loading and unloading easy. Beautiful backsplash with that accent lighting, multiple tiers of countertop space. The induction cooktop covers are gonna double as a cutting board. So if you need to you know, cut some stuff up you've got that this true induction cooktop is set up where you can actually pull this out and it's just a 110 plug where you can plug it in outside if you're cooking some stuff that might smell up the coach take that outside and make cleaning much easier but then it also does have a vent with the fan here with this nice aesthetic piece here if you do just want to get some ventilation in the coach and then you've got a big farmhouse style sink here huge sink I shouldn't say big this is absolutely huge a small child could take a bath in this sink if needed. And I really like how the front face of this sink gives it a real industrial feel. And then all of this hardware with that chrome, you've got more slide trays here for your trash and recycle. Again, dovetail construction. And if you need a little more countertop space, you can just press this little button right here and that will release your island there. Nice big drawers, again, dovetail construction, all soft clothes. Then your Fisher Pickel dishwasher with your silverware drawer and I love how they finish it out with the silverware dividers so many high-end finishes and when you look at you know how much money this coach costs for four hundred and fifty five thousand five hundred and fifty five dollars and all of the equipment and all of those little details there's a lot of value here you know, there's a lot of multi-million dollar homes that don't have the level of finishes that this coach has more storage Newmar is utilizing every little space with adjustable shelving very clean every cabinet that I've opened in here it's got this light color carpet. Everything is in excellent condition. Every little nook and cranny, again, dovetail construction on the drawer. I know I've said that a lot of times, but a lot of little details that add up and then a nice mirror here to just give you some depth. And here we've got the Whirlpool residential refrigerator with a water and ice dispenser, the pull-out freezer, 
And then you've got this huge pantry here, very well lit, very high-end finishes with these little racks right here. It's a lot of nice features in this coach. So and then this is a bath and a half. Now you do have your central vac hookup down there, but the wood inlay on this door, and I believe they call this a um, swiveling door to make it easy to get in and out of your half bathroom when the slide rooms come in. So as you can see, I've got plenty of room in this half bathroom. Beautiful backsplash, those same solid surface countertops. Again, all these cabinets are lined with carpet, extremely clean. A vent with a fan with that nice aesthetic piece as well. With the full wall slide, you're opening coming into the rear suite here is much larger. I'm gonna close this door here. So you can see you've got the distressed leather inlay on the doors, but real nice large doors. And then when we close these doors, I like to just point out how robust and firm, you know, you can hear it lock into place. We can really feel that quality as we go through this coach. Now, now the bedroom back here, you've got a king size bed with a Sony TV, and then you've got storage on both sides of your TV. Nice drawers, all finished out. Out, adjustable shelving again more storage here with drawer space lots of storage in your bedroom and again big deep drawers and they're utilizing every little space even with the smaller drawers and then more storage here on this side and then here in your bedroom we have a panel right here we can control the climate control floor heat monitor your tank levels and even look at the different cameras around the coach we can just if you maybe hear a noise outside the coach and just want to toggle around and see what's going on there nice to have that and i'm actually utilizing this coach right now if you look a little closely here on this side you can see that little green light My my phone was going dead, so I am utilizing this wireless charging port here. I really like having those wireless charging ports. You're not jacking around with cords, cell phone chargers. Just set that on your nightstand and it charges. And you can see it's green right now while it's charging, but over on this side, it's actually blue because it's you know ready to charge a cell phone. Two people can charge their phones while they're sleeping easily. And check out this bed. I gotta show you guys back here. When you lay down in this bed, you've got your generator start stop you can control your shades your ceiling lights all while laying in bed but then you've got this headboard here if you don't want to use that window behind your bed you have this headboard come out and I think that's it felt like real leather or suede uh, very high-end textures and then you do have windows on both sides of your bed and I really like this puck lighting that they put here overhead so you can see the cabinets are curved back right here so when you're laying down you have a little more head Bedroom, a little more clearance and then you have these lights that are right above you really nice and then this aesthetic piece that comes out here right here just gives it a really nice rich look and again that distressed leather on the faces of the slide room just such a high-end feeling nice size mirror back there but come on into the bathroom here because this is a sweet rear bath now this is something to get excited about first I got to show you guys the shower test in this huge shower I'm a big fan of this mosaic tile they've got the cool tile inlay on the wall with the vertical subway tiles a teak seat the beautiful mosaic tile on the floor of the shower and then this really cool drain you can see how many shower heads you have and then your shower head is like over top you know like a ceiling shower head just a really cool feel and we do have the cathedral ceilings here in the bathroom which are going to give you more headroom because there was a slight step when we came into this bathroom but there's basically a fiberglass molding on the ceiling here to give you more headroom back here and that really makes a big difference you've got a good amount of headroom but then i have this little step up here you can see a lot of headroom back here. Now, all kinds of cool finishes. You've got the backlit mirror, the beautiful bowl sinks. I love the two-tone cabinet with the light and dark. Again, when we open these medicine cabinets, everything is extremely clean and you just feel that quality when you open and close everything. And then the rear closet doors have that cream color distressed leather inlay, really nice look with that square look. And then you can see it's well lit when we open the rear closet you have adjustable shelving little shoe cubbies extra cushions there for your dinette so you can see the safe back here dual hanging as well and then we have the emergency egress door makes it really easy to get out of this coach if we need boom look at that just easy peasy 
and just you know even when we open and close that door you just feel that quality in this coach now probably wondering washer and dryer if you got a nice spot for your whirlpool stackable washer and dryer and just nice finishes like the little two-tone molding there around the crown again a crown molding in your bathroom i like that it's manual doors to go into your rear bathroom with that full length mirror there's a camera guy andrew holding it down back there always nice to have that full length mirror to make sure the whole outfit's looking good so if you are in the market for a highline diesel pusher that's late model well spec this 2017 king air is a great option with the 20,000 pound towing capacity the cummins 600 combined with this beautiful interior is a buy for 455,555 dollars serious and qualified buyers can contact bradley twait at the motor coach store in bradenton florida i greatly appreciate all of you that are subscribing to the channel and liking these videos i hope you're all having a great day thanks again